What's up everybody in YouTube land? It's your boy Kim, Mr. Rockoff Johnson here. And it is a brand new year. It is now 2016. I hope everyone had a fun and safe New Year's. Um, today is going to be a little bit different of a video. So what I'm going to do, I'm currently about to go pick up my friend. And she is going to help me clean out course mystique there because it's starting to be that time of year that it gets really cold and of course snow comes should do this a long time ago but I mean coming out it's December well it, it's January now but it was December and we didn't get any snow or anything it was 70 degrees on like December 23rd which was crazy but yeah so as you guys know that of course watch my YouTube I drive that white truck over there in the winter time or that's pretty much my daily driver and I don't really drive my FRS as much because of the whole rear wheel drive lightweight car thing the truck is whoop, did not realize the camera did that the truck is also rear wheel drive but I mean of course it's heavier than the car and I'm used to driving in the snow with the truck and I'm not about to try that in the FRS but uh yeah she doesn't know this but as soon as she gets in the car I'm going to shove the camera in her face. I'm going to ask her if she likes my car first of all. And if she does or doesn't, why? Reason being, so on YouTube and what I've done personally, I see all these people make videos. I love my, I love my car or I hate my car. This is what I love or hate about my car. I think I've said what I love about it. No, I've said what I've hated too. Well, not necessarily hate it, but I've said like pros and cons about owning it. Um, I haven't really made a what I love or hate about my car just strictly video like that yet but I don't know I might anyway I've never seen someone do it with like their friends like do you like my car so I've decided that's what I'm gonna do to her and um yeah so let's do this so Corinne Winifred Ew, not even my, not even my name, but okay. whatever say hello to YouTube. Why? Hi. Why? I Hi. am shoving the camera in your face. No thanks. Now the reason why <laughs> is because I'm going to ask you a question mm -hmm. and I want your honest answer and opinion. Yours. Okay. Are you ready? I'm assuming since you're talking to me, but okay. Right. Do you like my FRS? Um. And why? Why? Yep. And your honest opinion. I don't care if you hate this thing. I don't hate it. I like it because it goes fast and you know, you drift even when you don't want to, but it's louder than loud for no freaking reason. <laughs> Why are you laughing? I don't feel comfortable with this camera in my face though. Good! <laughs> Good! Come on, go Nessa Drive. So, that is, let me flip this out so I can actually see myself. That is her opinion on my car. And. I'll try to Do get I even some look good more opinions. I don't know. We'll see when it's on YouTube. Oh, Thank you no, no, you're for your gonna... honest no. opinion <laughs> and your help. No. Do you like my FRS and why? I like it because it's short, little, blue, and fast. Wait, what? I like it because it's short, little, blue, and fast. I think that's what I said. Yeah, that's what I said. All right, you're not just saying that, right? You. That's, that's my, your that's my me answer. Awesome. Sweet. Wait, oh, that's right. You actually drove it before. Yeah, it looks nice, yes. Oh, I'm sorry. I mostly like it for the look. I'm kind of shallow, so if it doesn't look right, you Okay. <laughs> cool. Where am I going? Um, the doors. <laughs> so you... See? Just switches out of nowhere. <laughs> um, Spontaneous. So, when you drove it, it felt good and everything. Well, I didn't really get to drive it, drive it. I, I creeped it around the parking lot, so I can't really get from now and saying stuff like that. That's right, you did. Well, it has to change. I'll let you drive it one day. Yes. So, that was his opinion. Uh, don't worry, you're not the only one. I'm doing it till I'm. I'm pretty sure I'm not. <laughs> so, cameras in your face. Hi. <laughs> I'm gonna ask you a question, okay? Sure. 
You are so calm. She is so calm about this. So, my FRS. You have driven it. Driven in it. I would rode in like it. to drive it. Nope. You have <laughs> rode it quite a bit of times. Now, what I want to know, you can be completely honest. I'm not going to be mad. I don't really care. What do you like about it if you like it? And if you don't like it, or if you just have complaints about it, period, what don't you like about it? Well, I've never driven a stock FRS. Let's start there. But I would never want to because your car is awesome. Um, I like the speed and like how you can tell the difference when you change gears. Um, I wish it was black. I just like black cars, like black and black interior. Especially because your interior has like little red accents, which would be cool. But um, the only thing I don't like about is the color. But everything else is really cool. Um, I like the way it handles around curves, how lightweight it is. Even though it's low to the ground, it like wouldn't resist speed, I guess. No, that's not what I'm looking for. Aerodynamic? Either way, your car is light, which makes it ideal for going around curves. And it helps the curve. It's really tight. It's a well-rounded car for it to be a smooth car. Not good in snow, but very good car. Actually, really nice. <laughs> <laughs> wow, only complaint. <laughs> I don't like the color. But you had the color black car before. You used to call it the black pearl. Yes, I did. I used to. I used to have a black car called the black pearl. Ah. I missed that car. Fun fact: I actually wanted my FRS in black. See? But it ended up not happening. You can always wrap it. That is true. You can always wrap. It. That is true. So. That's what she thinks about the car. Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> Alright, so now, of course, if you're watching this video, you already know what's going on and happening. Uh, there's only been one person I've ever let drive my car. <clears throat> Excuse me. And it's been my brother Bishop. And now, I'm going to ask him what he thinks about my car. Of course, again, not that it really matters, but. Figure something pretty cool. So, this is. Sir. Um, where do I start? Well, just say what you like about the car first and what you dislike about it. Hmm. What I like about the car is. I actually love the handle in that car. That handle is like crazy. At first, like. I remember when you first like used to talk about that car and driving. I'm like, oh, it's tired and all that and all that. Like, and I was like, I mean, it's cool. That's what you're into. Till you actually let me drive and like, once I started driving, like, put my foot in the metal on the pedal and all that. I was like, okay, now I get my key. I love this car. Like, it has a lot of power to it and the handle on it is crazy. Like, you have like full control over that car, especially because it's not big. So it's just like turning. It turns. You put that foot on the gas, that engine's roaring, it feels it feels good. But um I don't really have any dislikes about it. The only thing I really probably is the little dislike is just because the cockpit is a little bit small. Like if you're a taller person like like I am, it's like you gotta, you gotta get comfortable with it, but yeah, other than that, there's no problem with it. Alright, cool beans. Now uh well, so I can see if I can even see myself. Right. So um, the reason why I let Bishop drive my car is because I had to, I, I wanted him to run an errand for me real quick. And, <laughs> okay, so I know this is not just me that it happens to. Like, I used to tell them all the time that guys, and no no offense, no offense to you if you, if you have a Honda, but guys in Hondas, they always want to do stuff with you. It ha evidently it happened to him while he was in the car. You mind saying that story real quick? Oh, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> um, one time I was driving the car and where was it coming from? I actually wasn't driving the errand for you, kid. I think sometimes let me hold the car for some reason. Oh yeah, that's right. When you go on lunch breaks and everything. Yeah, and I was coming from a girl's house. That's where I was coming from. <laughs> and, uh, <laughs> and a guy in a Honda like pulls up like at the at the light next to me and starts on the car. I'm like, oh man, I think he wants to race. And I'm like, this is not my car, I'm not going to race him. And so like, he starts revving his engine, looking over at me. I'm like, gosh, I really want to though. And so like, I started to rev the engine. 
And I'm like, you know what? I'm gonna just pull his chain. So I start to rub the engine. He's starting to like rev his engine again and waiting for the light to turn green. So like, part of me really wanted to race him, but I was like, yeah, say, yeah, it's not my car. So rev the engine, it's roaring really loud, and as soon as the light turns green, I start to take all like screws like he did, and I just stopped. Let him keep going. <laughs> but he was in town racing. I was like, dang, Keon said this happens to him all the time. And it happened to me like one of the, what, three times I've actually driven a car. So, yeah. I told him I would not have cared if he raced them so long as he won. <laughs> that was my thing. I just wanted him to win. Like, okay, sure. You can race them. I don't care. I was not about to do that. <laughs> Oh man, but overall, you you like you like the well you like Mystique, right? Yeah, I like the girl. I've never asked anybody else in my videos this, but if you had a chance to buy the car, would you? Why and why not? If if you chose to, why? Why if not? Why not? I don't mean. I wouldn't be opposed to buying it. I mean, like, like I said, I mean, if I had the type of money to buy a car, I would probably just buy a BMW because that's the cars I like, I love. So I'd buy, like, a M3 or something like that. But I don't know. I wouldn't be opposed to it because, like I said, it's a really good car. Um, only thing, like, that would be on my mind about is, like, driving in the snow. I would like something that you can drive year-round. Of course, that's not, like, a year-round car. But, um, not at all. No, yeah, like it's still a really good car though. I wouldn't have no problem with it, especially like if you if you're living in a place that's like sunny most of the time, or for a lot majority of the time, then yeah, it's a pretty cool car. Cool beans. Thank you for that, Bishop. Not really. <laughs> <laughs> so that's pretty much gonna conclude this video and everything. Uh, put down in the comments below. Any, any one of you that, you know, not even just the FRS, just the car, period. Whatever your car is, try asking some of your friends, like, you know, if they like it. Even though, even if it doesn't matter to you, just, just ask them just to see what they like about it. Because it might make you rethink your car. As in, like, you know, if someone says, oh, I, I like the car and all, but it does this weird, you know, gear change. And you might not have even noticed it before. And then you think about, it, like, oh, wait, it does? And it might, you know, just make you be more aware of certain things with your car. But um uh yeah, just put down in the comments below, you know, what it is and if people like it or not. But um uh yeah, as always, subscribe and you stay classy. Be out, be out, shorty, be out. <laughs>